In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to save web pages on your Android device so you can view them later. I'll also be showing you guys how to delete the web pages because if you have too many, you're going to run out of space on your phone. So, the browser we're going to be using today is the Chrome browser. It comes with every Android device, so it's easy to find. Okay, so let's say you're on this web page and you find the article interesting. And you decide that, okay, you keep it and read it for later because you're currently busy or for whatever reason it is. What you want to do is just come up here to the menu icon on the top right, tap the icon you see, and then tap this little icon that has this arrow pointing downwards. This will download the page you are currently viewing. So you see down here it says 10 ideal Android browsers with adblock that are free. I need to let you guys know that um, before you download a page, before you do all that stuff I just did, make sure the page is done loading. Like make sure all the pictures have been displayed and uh, all the videos are loaded. So when the page gets saved on your phone and um, you feel like you should get back to whatever it is you're doing, you can close your browser and when you're ready to view the page again, just open your browser and this time I'm going to turn off my internet because I want to show you guys that it actually works even when you don't have an internet connection. So I'm going to turn it off now. Yeah, so as you can see over here, it has this little icon on the top right. And this means that the page has been saved. So you can easily just tap it or go through here because some of you may not be having this icon. Don't worry, it's normal. You tap that little icon to access your menu and then come down to downloads. And uh, you may have a lot of files here that you've downloaded in the past. But for me, I only have two. So, you can either tap this one because this is the name of the web page that you saved, or you tap this icon that says pages and it should display all the pages that you have saved before. So, tap it to open the page. And I don't have internet right now, but the page is showing up. You will notice that um, this is not the same font like the one on the main page. I want you guys to know this um, you can't view videos on offline pages because. Videos need an internet connection to stream, or you can view pictures, pictures get saved. Yeah, now that's how you save web pages and open them using Chrome browser on your Android phone. Now I'm going to show you guys how to delete the web pages because like I said, if you have too many of them, you're going to end up taking up a lot of space on your phone and you don't want that. So I'm going to restart it now. Yep, this is what you'll see when you start your Chrome browser and you come up here tab downloads and then come up to pages and you have all the pages for me it's just one so you can tap this little icon here and then tap delete and it should be gone sadly chrome doesn't ask you if you're sure you want to delete it but uh, you can undo that if you made a mistake by tapping this but well, it's gone now <laughs> So that's how you save and delete offline web pages on your Android phone using your Chrome browser. If you guys have any questions, just let me know in the comments and I'll try to answer them. If I don't have the answers to the questions, I'll refer you to people that do. So you guys should stay safe and uh, I'll be seeing you guys next time. Yeah, and that icon is gone. <laughs>